Suppose that I am going to organize my batteries in 12 volts. 12 volts times the intensity. How much should be the intensity if the system is 12 volts? The intensity will be 6,000 divided by 12. How much is that? 500 amps. All right. This is if I use 12 volts. Suppose that I am going to, to obtain 6,000 watts. That's the power, but uh, with 24 volts. 24 volts times the intensity. Then intensity is 6,000 divided by 24. How much is that? 250 amps. No. I am going to organize the batteries in 48 volts. OK, the, the same amount of power, but right now, 48 volts. How much should be the intensity? It's 6,000 divided by 48. How much is that? 125? OK, amps. Oh, Papi, pay attention. All of those groups of batteries, they produce the same power. However, if I configure the batteries in a higher voltage, the amount of amps that I need to collect is less. And the size of the cable will be smaller. Oh, wow. This is why today the majority of the electrical vehicles, the battery bank, how much is the, the, the voltage of the battery bank in the majority of the new vehicles? 480 volts, 560 volts, in order to collect the less amount of amps. Of course. At the end of the day, that voltage time, the intensity, produce the power that you need. But if you configure it in higher voltage, you need to collect less amps, less amps. Is clear, guys? 